Right, the next step is the center console. So, I made the center console when I made the dash. Um, excuse everything, it's very dusty for me in my workshop. The idea of the center console was originally that it stays um, with the black finish, but it didn't finish off as nicely as the dash did. So, if you can have a look, you will see it's a bubble that I had in it, and it, it, there's quite a few of these little bubbles and chips, they're not very nice. So, I'm going to take the center console out, and I'm going to cover it with the same, this, this felting that I've been using on the, the panels here. I'll be using that for the center panel console. Right, there's the center console, I've got it out now. Quite dusty. This was completely made by me. Um, I'll show you what it looks like here now. And so you can actually see the mechanism now for the, the control yoke. Um, this is how the aircraft originally was. This was all open over here. Um, I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. I just liked it to be closed. It gives the aircraft a slightly more complete look. So I will be covering that center console in felt and then that will be that complete. Okay, so the job for today, um, this is the old windshield. Um, so it's completely broken and stuff. Uh, I need to cut it anyway. See, here's the roll of new polycarb. Um, so I will be opening it and cutting. It's also, this one's thicker, it's actually double the thickness. Three moles. The older one was about 1.6, 1.7 moles thick, so it's going to have a little bit, bit of a weight penalty there. Hopefully not too much, but we'll see. We'll weigh it once we're done. Um, it will be better anyway. Also, the sheets that come in one point five mils they don't actually come big enough um, so you have to glue on the ends as you can see here uh, they've got pieces added on um, this rolling three three millimeters more than thick enough so let's do that as you can see I've got the windshield now on top of the old uh, the new old windshield on top of the big sheet I've got here can now also see the extent of the damage on this old, old windshield it's cracks and everything so anyway that's the size of it we will cut it out I did weigh the old windshield the old one weighed at four kgs so the new one should be in the region of about eight let's see right I'm gonna cut it out I'm planning to use my multi-tool for this um, let's see how it goes.
This should go faster. Let's all cut out now. Okay, I've clamped the two together, the old one over the new one. I'm now going to drill all the holes out for rivets and bolts. Um, most of it's attached by rivets, so yes, let me get to drilling all the holes out. I've chilled all the holes out now. Next thing and last step will be just to trim off all the loose tip. Okay, I've now finished deburring all the holes. I sanded the edges right. In the airplane I actually cleaned the whole part here. Um, I'm about to install this canopy over here now um, this aluminium strip goes over it what I will do is I'll peel the stuff back just enough so that I can rivet them on I won't peel the whole thing um, for the protection of the canopy at the moment but I think this will do Okay, let's put on the canopy.
on the inside I've peeled away over here so at a later stage it will make it easier to pull the plastic off the moment I'm leaving it on there from the outside it gets riveted to there I've put the one bolt in there now down at the bottom here gets a rivet in here over there and so forth Look okay, I've got the basic canopy on now. You can see on the top all the rivets there. Down the sides. And then there's rivets here. There's a piece of just still run in the middle there. I haven't got down to it in the inside. Um, and these holes here, they just plain and simply for the side panels that come on over here which I will still install um, definitely didn't go on without a fight but it's looking good I'm quite pleased okay I finished covering this center console as you can see got the rubber trim around here that hole is for the GPS which should just pop straight into there that's it, just clips in there right let's see about putting it in there that's it that's just to fit loosely fit it in there Right, so I've only got a few things now that I've finished the canopy in that. Um, in the next video, I need to get these things fixed. Should I say fixed, replaced? You can see how those holes have stretched over there. It's not round anymore. So these are braces that go over here for the feet and in the next video too I would like to start putting all the fiberglass panels back on the side for the canopy and everything um, so I need to complete that up as well for the next video anyway hope you enjoyed watching this thanks for watching and I would appreciate the like thank you